Radar Auto showed the world that it was ready to compete when it rolled out a $20,000 electric pickup truck late last year. And now, a few months after its launch in the Chinese market, the company has announced that the Radar RD6 electric pickup truck is coming to international markets. This is big news, and manufacturers like Ford and Toyota are starting to worry because, at that price point, the Radar RD6 is sure to entice a lot of people. Join us as we take a look at this new affordable pickup and how it is set to change the industry. Radar Auto is a high-end, new energy outdoors lifestyle vehicle brand created by Zhejiang Geely Holding Group, one of China's largest automobile manufacturers. They focus on producing electric pickup trucks and SUVs, and they have plans to make electric all-terrain vehicles, ATVs, too. Their current product is the RD6, an electric pickup truck that uses Geely's Sustainable Experience Architecture, SEA, platform. The RD6 was launched last year and stands out for its affordability. Now, Radar Auto aims to introduce this electric pickup to the international market. They have their own research and development facility in Hangzhou and a production facility in Zibo, Shandong. Additionally, they benefit from the design expertise of Peter Horbury, a British design veteran and Geely Auto's EVP of design. Geely Group recently shared on Twitter that the first batch of Geely's electric pickup trucks for export has successfully rolled off the assembly line at the Zibo Smart Factory, and it has generated quite a buzz online. The company expressed its confidence in the smooth progress of this endeavor. Pickup trucks have long been a symbol of American automotive culture, dominating the roads with their rugged charm and versatility. However, their popularity has historically been confined to the United States and a few other regions, while other parts of the world have favored smaller vehicles and alternative transportation options. However, the landscape changed when Tesla demonstrated the potential of electric trucks, and other major players like Ford, Rivian, and GM also introduced their electric truck models. This shift in the market opened up new opportunities globally for electric trucks. And now, Radar Auto aims to capitalize on that growing trend and secure a portion of the market share for itself. Let's take a look at the Radar RD6. The Radar RD6 electric pickup truck, while not imposing in size, exhibits a design that strikes a perfect balance between modernity and understated elegance. From certain angles, its unassuming appearance may even be perceived as minimalistic, adding a touch of sophistication to its overall appeal. At the front, the RD6 has a clamshell hood that features a prominent radar emblem, proudly announcing its brand identity. It also has a full-width LED light bar that stretches across the front, creating a distinctive and futuristic look. It has a closed grille positioned at the center, and this grille is flanked by full LED headlamps on either side that is sure to provide adequate illumination for nighttime driving. The bumper has a slight protrusion and features large intake housings, with a faux skid plate covering the lower section. When viewed from the sides, the RD6 boasts an attractive appearance. Its carved fenders and chunky door-mounted mirrors complement the chrome and matte black trim accents. However, some might find the 17-inch wheels to be slightly small, especially considering the truck's marketing as a vehicle suited for lifestyle and adventure. Moving to the rear, the RD6 continues its well-styled design, largely due to the presence of LED tail lamps with a unique X-shaped design for the main units, adding a touch of distinctiveness to its appearance. Overall, the Radar RD6 presents a modern and stylish option in the electric pickup truck market. Now let's take a look at the inside of the RD6. As soon as you enter the cabin, you will notice how well-trimmed and respectably modern it looks. One of the main features is the expansive 55-inch panoramic sunroof that lets in plenty of natural light and gives you a great view of the sky. The seats are covered with stitched leather upholstery that feels soft and comfortable, and they have metallic accents that add some flair to the interior. The design of the doors and the AC vents is streamlined and elegant, 
creating a sense of quality and sophistication. The climate control buttons are arranged in a stylish way, and they have a nice touch and feel. The steering wheel is wrapped with leather and has a flat bottom shape that makes it look sporty and classy. The RD6 also offers many storage options for your convenience. You can find a large 48-liter storage space hidden underneath the rear seats, where you can store your luggage or other items securely. There are also other places to put your belongings, such as the center console area, the door pockets, the space under the center armrest, and the pockets behind the front seats. There is even a small cubby right under the rear AC vents where you can put your phone or other small items. The rear seats have a center armrest that provides some comfort and support, but they don't have much reclining ability because there's not much space behind them due to the compact size of the RD6. For the motor, the RD6 uses a special type of battery called NI55, which has a high energy density. This means that it can store more energy in a smaller space, making it more efficient and powerful. The battery also works with Bosch's iBooster Intelligent Energy Recovery System, which is a smart technology that can capture some of the energy that is usually lost when you brake or slow down the car. This energy is then sent back to the battery, making it last longer. The iBooster system can increase the battery life by up to 30%, which is very impressive. The battery of the RD6 is also very safe and reliable, thanks to several protection systems that prevent any damage or accidents. For example, there is the Smart Electrical Safety Protection System, which monitors the electrical components of the car and prevents any short circuits or overloads. There is also the Four Circuit Protection, which divides the battery into four parts and isolates them if there is any problem. There is also the Lock Car Discharge Protection, which stops the battery from losing power when the car is locked and not in use. And there is also the over-temperature and over-current leakage protection, which prevents the battery from getting too hot or leaking any current. Another cool feature of the RD6's battery is that you can check how much power it has left by using your smartphone. You just need to download an app and connect it to your car. And then you can see how much battery you have left, how far you can go, and when you need to charge it again. The RD6 offers three different options for the battery size, depending on your needs and preferences. The biggest one has a capacity of 100 kilowatt hours, which means that it can store a lot of energy and make the car go very far. According to the test done in China, where the car is made, this battery can make the RD6 travel up to 632 kilometers or 392 miles on a single charge. That's very impressive for an electric car. The smallest battery option has a capacity of 63 kilowatt hours, which is still quite good for an electric car. This battery can make the RD6 go up to 400 kilometers or 248 miles on a single charge, according to the Chinese test. This is enough for most daily trips and short journeys. The middle option has a capacity of 86 kilowatt hours, which is a good balance between power and efficiency. This battery can make the RD6 go up to 550 kilometers or 341 miles on a single charge, according to the Chinese test. This is a great range for longer trips and more adventurous drivers. So, where will the Radar RD6 be available for sale? Currently, there is no specific information on the exact markets where the Radar RD6 will be sold. However, one person inquired about its availability in Australia on Geely's post, and they responded with a teaser saying, stay tuned to find out. Also, back in May, Lincoln Co., an automaker jointly owned by Geely and Volvo, shared their plans for expansion into other European markets. They expressed their intentions to introduce their Chinese-made hybrid SUV called Zero One in black and blue to countries like Norway, Austria, Switzerland, and the UK in the near future. Furthermore, Lincoln Co.'s ambition extends to potentially entering the US market at a later stage. So, while the exact global availability of the Radar RD6 remains undisclosed, it's evident that Geely's broader automotive ventures are exploring new markets and regions, including potential expansions into Europe and the United States. What do you think about this? Let us know down in the comments section.